Hey, what's up, guys? It's Pokemon Prime, and today I'm reacting on My Little Pony Fetch Fish Magic Season 2, Episode 17, Hearts and Hooves Day. Must be Valentine's Day. Let's begin. 3, 2, 1. What a beautiful day. Oh. Hmm. I just don't feel like the Cutie Mark Crusaders. I know what you mean. If it's for Miss Shirley, it needs to be perfect. Hearts and Hooves Day only comes once a year, after all. Yeah, it's like Valentine's Day. Yeah, it's shaped like hearts. Glitter. Glitter. Now that'll show Miss Cheerleaf how much you care about her. Just have to get into the hearts and hoops party at school. Hearts and hoops party. I think we're gonna need a bigger envelope. To Jaws. I think we're gonna need a bigger boat. Happy Valentine's Day. You mean like pin the tail on the donkey? Do you guys have donkeys in that world? What? What's with the face? So they're talking about Big Mac? I had skipped to the song, sorry. Sweetie Belle is right! Big Macintosh is the perfect match for Miss Cheerilee. He's really nice, super hard working, and strong. But he's also pretty shy. He's never gonna ask Miss Cheerilee to be his very special son pony. Maybe he doesn't have to. Huh? If we can get Big Mac and Miss Cheerilee in a really romantic setting, I bet she'll ask him. Sounds like a plan to me. So, what are we waiting for? Let's get outside and create the perfect day! Yeah. Woohoo! Flowers! Don't forget the flowers! Oops! I'm on it! Here she comes! And here he He's comes! Coming. They're both coming! <laughs> Alright, let's hide. Hi, girls! Hi, Hi Miss Cheerilee! So you three said you needed help identifying a tree you found here near the gazebo? <coughs> That's an apple tree. Use it! <laughs> Where is it? <laughs> oh, sorry, big brother. We went and fixed up the gazebo all on our own. See? As long as you're here, why not have a bite to eat from this romantic-looking picnic? Oh, mm. gosh. Seems like there's only room for two. I uh, guess we'll just be going, then. <laughs> Later. Mood music. You really think this will work? Of course it will work. They're perfect for each other. Yeah, just look at them. Beautiful day we're having. Yep. Nope. I knew he was gonna say that. Any big plans for tonight? Nope. Nope. See, I knew it. That's all he says. Yep and nope. Oh come on, Miss Cheerilee. It's going to be a very special 
special so proudly. To be your Valentine's. Oh my gosh, look. What? <gasps> Big Mac? Nope. Oh, something stuck in your teeth. Oh, shut up. Well, this has been strange. Nope. Yep. I need to get going, but it's always great running into a good friend. Nope. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, dang it. Do you think it just wasn't romantic enough? Maybe it was too romantic. Either way, we failed. Oh, there's gotta be something else we can- Oh! Oh, hey, Twilight. Oh my goodness, I didn't even see you there. I'm so, so sorry. Oh, it's okay, Twilight. It was an accident. I've just been reading the most fascinating book about Hearts and Hooves Day. Did you know that this holiday got its start because of a love potion? Love potion? Did you say a love potion? That's right, it even has the recipe. No I way. I suppose we could borrow that book for a little while. Leah? Of course you can. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Perfect. I have another book here that I think you'll... They, they're they gone. They're gone. They must be ghosts. <laughs> Take a tuft of cloud. <laughs> a bright rainbow's glow. Pegasus feather. Hey! Fast, not slow. Some do ponies who aren't in the know. Let's just hope it works. I feel kind of bad tricking my brother and Miss Cherry this way. What's the problem? We all agree these two are perfect for one another. Yeah. Yeah, they just need a little nudge. And what could make them happier than being together, right? Again, girl. Hello, big back. What's up? Would you three like to tell us why it was so very important that we meet you here? Punch! Punch. Excuse you me. me. Punch! We need punch. We were gonna set up a stand and try to sell it, but <laughs> we needed some honey to taste test it first. Yep. Hey, you that's Mc Big Mac's together. line. To test it. Together. So, uh, we'll just leave you two alone. <laughs> Together, to test it. I'm very sorry about this. I mentioned to the girls that I don't have a very special Ooh. sun pony. And Excuse I believe me. they're putting us in these awkward myself. situations because they've decided it should be you. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose we should just humor them for a moment. And this punch does look delicious. Yep. Yep. Come on, I think they're gonna taste drink it. it to good friends. Friends? More than friends once they're they drink it. it. They're drinking it! And just wait till they start seeing each other and... It worked! They're looking into each other's eyes! <laughs> they're and about to be in for a big surprise! <gasps> It worked. Aww. He's my schmoopy doopy sweetie weedy pony pie. Aww. Wait, what? You're my schmoopy doopy sweetie weedy pony pie. Okay. Did he just say? Uh oh. The potion's getting a pan. Yeah, he's talking more. What's going on? I don't know, he was Mr. talking Lee, more. Are you alright? I have a special sum pony. A kissy, wissy, wuggy, wuggy, sugar bear. Oh no. It's definitely out of control. Give them 
Pumpkin pie. I love pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie is my favorite kind of pie, especially on Thanksgiving. Mom, my brother's acting like a grade A goofball. Maybe we added too much rainbow. Or maybe not enough clouds. Maybe the uh-oh. What do you mean, uh-oh? Uh-oh, spaghettios. Surely a love potion. We may have given them a love poison. Poison? Apparently, some prince a long time ago whipped up this recipe and gave it to this princess we liked. He meant it to be a love potion, but things didn't turn out so well. How not so well did things turn out? Well, there's something here about a dragon, the kingdom falling, chaos reigning. Okay, apparently it was all because the prince and princess were so lost in each other's eyes that they couldn't perform their royal duty. Do this? What the heck does that mean? We not only turned Big Mac and Miss Cheerley into a couple of nonsense bottom knicker poops, <laughs> knicker poops. Oh. Come on, Apple Bloom. Miss Cheerley and Big Mac don't have any royal duties, but they still have responsibility. If we don't fix this, oh no, Miss Cheerley won't be able to teach. Big Mac won't be able to harvest any apples. Yeah. And before you know it. School will be canceled. Apples will be oh, rotten. Be the the yeah. Be tiny eyes. Oh, 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 Really? So gross when you're looking at like that. Uh oh. Hi, Miss Shirley. How are you? I have a very special sub pony. I have a very special sub pony. Yeah, we noticed. Gosh, you two are so in love. The next thing you know, you'll be getting married. Married? Yep, and then once you get married, you're gonna, you know, go on a honeymoon, have some kids, and even maybe get a job. Your fiance. For your fiance. Don't you think you should start looking for your wedding dress? You'll want to look your best for your honey bunny snuggle baby. No, not that way. Now we just need to keep them apart. For an hour. You two do the same as Big Mac. No problem. Meet you back at the clubhouse in an hour when the whole mess is over. This one looks nice. Better try it on. Aha! Perfect! Ten minutes down, fifty minutes to go. Mel! Mel! Not that one either. Nada. Nopey, nopey, nope. Mel, you know, something less shiny. Something less shiny. Excuse me. How much time is left? I'm running out of ways to make diamonds say we're by you. We still have 25 minutes. Oh. Where's my brother? He made his purchase and departed out the back. 
said something about needing to see his selfish move. Oh no! Oh, are you gonna puke every time they say that? I'll see what I can do to slow him down. You go on to Carousel Boutique and more sweet baby. That's it, and weights and ropes. Excellent. <laughs> what the? Oh no. Oh no, it's almost an hour over. We need to keep them what more happened? apart before. What happened, Bloom? Where's Big Mac? On his way. Gotta keep him out of boutique. Aha! Huh? Yes! It's working! Oh, sorry! Wait. Oh my goodness, she's more stronger! No. The hour's almost over! We gotta keep them more apart! Big Mac, stop! Big Mac! Big back. No, no, please, stop. Stop. Get away. Don't get to her. She's too small. Let her go. Wait, what? Oh, <sighs> I sure am glad you found those shovels. Ha 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 ha. Sorry. It's almost an hour oh, over. Uh oh. Oh no. No! Stop! Come on! Too late. Am I wearing a wedding veil? Yep. Are you sitting on a feather bed in a hole in the ground? Yep. Girls, can uh. you explain why I look like I'm getting married at the bottom of a pit? Oh, thank goodness, they're me normal. I've given you the teeny tiniest bit of love potion that may have turned out to actually be a love poison. Poison? And you may have gone just a tiny bit nutty. Our hearts and hooves were in the right place. We appreciate that you care about us and want us to be happy, but... But no matter how good our intentions might have been, we should have never meddled in your relationship. No pony can force two ponies to be together. It's up to every pony to choose that very special some pony for themselves. We're sorry. And you can think about how sorry you are while you're doing all of Big Mac's chores at Sweet Apple Acres. Does that seem like a fair punishment to you? Yep. Oh, so they are like each other, without a love potion or poison. Aww. Hey there, Miss Cheerily. What are you doing here? Since you three are doing all of his chores, Big Mac and I thought we'd have a picnic at the gazebo. Ready, sugar bear? Yep, pumpkin pie. <gasps> the poison! Oh, they're faking it. Yes! Yes! Those two are perfect for each other. So that was my reaction on Hearts and Hooves Day. Almost like Valentine's Day. So remember to like, subscribe, hit the bell, and smash it! And I'll see you guys next time on the next reaction.